at this beautiful beach and see a beach toy shop the shopkeeper is finding out how many toys are left in his shop come let us learn subtraction of three digit numbers ending in zeros with him the shopkeeper had 800 beach toys out of which he sold 347 how many toys are left in the shop here we have to subtract 347 from 800 to find out how many beach toys are left let us begin let us again represent each 100 with a green dot each 10 with a red dot and each one with a blue dot the number 800 has 8 hundreds zero tens and zero ones and the number 347 has 3 hundreds four tens and seven ones so the number 800 will be represented like this with dots now let us cancel the dots equal to the digit in the subtrahend in each column starting with the dots in the ones column first then the dots in the tens column and lastly the dots in the hundreds column now there are seven ones in 347 so we need to cancel seven blue dots but we cannot cancel seven blue dots from zero blue dots so we need to regroup one red dot from the tens column as we know that one red dot is equal to 10 blue dots but look there are zero red dots we cannot borrow one red dot from zero red dots so we regroup one green dot to 10 red dots as we know that one green dot is equal to 10 red dots now we have 10 red dots so now we can regroup one red dot to 10 blue dots also so now we have 10 blue dots 9 red dots and 7 green dots after all the regrouping now let us cancel the dots equal to the subtrahend 347 10 blue dots minus 7 blue dots is equal to 3 blue dots that is 3 ones 9 red dots minus 4 red dots is equal to 5 red dots that is 5 tens and 7 green dots minus 3 green dots is equal to 4 green dots that is 4 hundreds so we get in all 4 hundreds 5 tens and 3 ones which is equal to 453 thus there are 453 beach toys left in the shop now let us subtract the numbers 800 and 
hundred forty seven directly. Step one Write the numbers in the hundreds, tens, and ones columns. Step two Regroup hundreds, tens, and ones. So we regroup eight hundreds as seven hundreds plus one hundred. Now we regroup one hundred as nine tens plus one ten. Lastly, we regroup one ten as ten ones. Thus, we get eight hundred is equal to seven hundred plus ninety plus ten. Step three subtract the ones. That is ten minus seven is equal to three. Write three in the ones column. Step four subtract the tens. That is nine minus four is equal to five. Write five in the tens column. Step five subtract the hundreds. That is seven minus three is equal to four. Write four in the hundreds column. So we got the answer as four hundred fifty three. Eight hundred minus three hundred forty seven is equal to four hundred fifty three. Hey, look at the colorful baby floats. They look so beautiful. The shopkeeper had three hundred such floats. He sold one hundred twenty three out of them. How many baby floats are still left? Here we have to subtract one hundred twenty three from three hundred. To find out the number of baby floats left in the shop. So let's regroup the number 300 in hundreds, tens, and ones. So 300 is regrouped as 200 plus 100. Now we regroup 100 as 9 tens plus 1 10. Lastly, we regroup the 1 10 as 10 ones. Thus, we get 300 is equal to 200 plus 90 plus 10. Now, subtract the ones. That is 10 minus 3 is equal to 7. Subtract the tens. That is 9 minus 2 is equal to 7. Lastly, subtract the hundreds. That is 2 minus 1 is equal to 1. So, we get 300 minus 123 is equal to 177. Hence, the shopkeeper still has 177 floats to sell. Wasn't it fun helping the shopkeeper?